All right, just another comparison here. I wanna compare Azure AD roles to the Azure roles, the RBAC versions. So AD roles, they are used to control access to AD resources and Azure roles control access to Azure resources. And here's a good representation here where you have uh, AD roles on the left-hand side and Azure roles on the right-hand side. Uh, and the idea on the left-hand side, that actually represents like Office 365, but you can see Azure AD um, has uh, um, some coverage both inside and outside of Azure. So an AD resource could be something like users, groups, billing, uh, licensing, application registration, or et cetera. Uh, and then on the right-hand side for Azure resources, this could be virtual machines, databases, cloud storage, cloud networking, and et cetera. By default, Azure roles and eight Azure AD roles do not span Azure and eight and Azure AD. And by default, the global administrator doesn't have access to Azure resources. So uh, that's just good to know. And global administrators can gain access to Azure resources if granted the user access administrator role, so the Azure role. So there you go.